top of the morning, family. Top of the morning, man. Hopefully, y'all having a blessed day out there. Well, if you up listening to my voice, you're pretty blessed because you woke up to see another day. So all praise to the most high. Uh, I'm not a financial advisor. The one thing I'm going to tell you to invest in is invest in yourself, family. Make sure you're good mentally because the stocks can go up and down, but you don't want your emotions to follow that same trend. You see what I'm saying? Make sure you plant it on solid ground. So with that being said, um, market's looking pretty good today. Um, I hopped in Nokia a while back. I told you guys about that. Um, but I am personally probably going to take some profit today. I got in BlackBerry at $7. It hit nineteen seventy this morning. I sold a few shares. I'll probably let go a few of my um, Nokia contracts as well. With that being said, right now in this market, in these times, make sure you guys set trailing stop losses, family. And let me run through it real quick how you set a trailing stop loss. It's very simple, and it can save you a lot of money. So you want to keep them profits. You go to your market sale, you go down to trail and stop loss. You put your percentage in. So say BlackBerry, the highest price is 1988. I'm sorry, uh, Rocket Mortgages. I put 5%. So basically, if it drops down 5% under the highest price, it will trigger a sale. As you see, I put it all the way out until September, right? Now I put the number of shares. Um, and then I'm just going to go ahead and do, you know, so, so once you do that, now what happens if rocket does drop five percent from whatever the highest price is even if it gets to 28 it'll go five percent from there right so always do that to to make sure you get them profits and you don't watch the stock plummet and and missed out on those profits so that's a good way to do it um as far as nokia i had these 39 calls like i said i'll probably sell most of my june 4th calls today and just take a little bit of that profit and maybe drop it in a, a stock that is kind of low um rocket companies i'm still in there I'm holding, I think I got 125 shares and I got a few calls, you know, they hit 49 a couple months back. So I'm looking 25. If they hit there, I'll probably sell AMC. I mean, it shocked a lot of people, including me. So again, with the, all the retail investors in the market, you just never know what's going to happen. Hey, family, if the video helped at all, y'all like, subscribe, man. Y'all have a blessed day. Let's eat.